Robert Kennedy here at Neptune Diving Resort. This is where we spent years getting our Dive Master certification here in Mobile. A lot has changed here in Mobile. Not only did they have the typhoon come through here and rip everything out, but the government says that uh, all the buildings built on the beach have to be removed. Even a few meters of Neptune. Here, I'll show you where the, the line is. Right there. There's uh, three meters. If you can see that. Yeah. Three meters. Three and then, meters then there's a red line over there on the wall. It says there's a No new structures to be built. There used to be a... There used to be a big building here. Yeah, stairs. Right here used to be a building. Still got some buildings there. We got Chili Bar. They took off the roof there. And then uh, we come on down here, we go to Saavedra. Come on, let's take a walk. Let's go for a walk. This is a cool place. Good morning. Good morning. Souvenirs. Souvenirs? What's your name? Huh? Joa? Loa. Loa? Cool. I, I think I already got some of those. Maybe I'll try later. Thank you. Chili bar. Chili bar is like the oldest bar here. It's very cool. Right out on the water. And we come down here. To the left we have the Saavedra Motels. Ooh, they tore it down. Oh wow, this is the Chinese place. They used to have a restaurant here. Yeah. They're tearing everything down. It's on the coast. So they're going to make a, make a beach. And then... Here's a Saavedra rooms. Oh, look at the roof. Yeah. Look at that roof. Oh, no. Oh, look at all Another roof destroyed. Jeez. No, all the roofs. All, all the roofs are destroyed here. This is where Sir Klaus used to teach. Oh, yeah. Saavedra. This, this is, is where we found him. Saavedra is where we first met uh, Klaus, the marine biologist that's in... Uh, Darwin now. Is that his picture? No, that's not him. No, that's not him. <laughs> but he used to have a, a, a picture of his shots. Oh yeah, he had uh, pictures that he had taken. Yeah. Get over here in the shade. This is the coolest place. It's like uh, it's like Pirates of the Caribbean here. The one of the places. Good morning, Amigos Dive Center, huh? Is that Amigos? Hello. Good morning. There's, there's famous Anthony's. That was the first motel I ever stayed at here. Let's go out here. There used to be a pier right there. I don't think you'll see it. Nothing there. I wonder if we can go out here. Pizza place. Pizza. Let's go see the. They got this. They got this all torn down right now. Look at that. It's all torn down. It used to be. Nice dining area here, and then you could walk out here to the uh, 
There's a little cabana out in the middle of the, the water there. They have the sardines run right here is where all the sardines are. Look, they cleaned up. They have a beach here now. There didn't used to be a beach. There used to be just all the uh, buildings and stuff. But they're making everybody remove everything. Oh, so sad. All the buildings are gone and destroyed. So sad, so sad. Lion Dive Center. This is the first dive center I dived at here in Mobile. I didn't know that Mobile was a scuba town. And I saw all the scuba shops. And then uh, I just had to go for a dive. I was already certified, so no problem there. This is uh, the entrance. Like when you first come into Mobile Town, this is what you're going to see. This is the entrance of Panaksama. The entrance of Panaksama here. Oh. Hey! hey. <laughs> lots of lots of transportation here. Lots of guys waiting to give you a ride. Hello. We got healthy foods. We got veranda. Oh, we got the police. Did you bring your mask? Yeah. How about you? I don't think so. And then we come down this road here, and this is where we stayed for a year or two or this something. Is where Quite a long time. Cebu Dive Center. In Cebu Dive Center, where the very cool Cameron Forbush used to be the manager. But it's closed now. Is it closed? Yeah. Just temporary. I guess Cameron's gone. They don't have business anymore. Oh, uh, they had to tear down part of their. Look at that. They had to tear down part of their resort too. Oh man. What a mess. They made them tear it all down. This was our first apartment up there. That was, it's two apartments now, but it used to be one. We used to like to stay there a lot. Yeah. It was really the nice. Thing. We have the whole thing. You got kind of a beach view up there. You could lay down on a hammock, on the patio. Very nice place. And that's Enzo's and Arlene's store, and it's destroyed. It's gone. Why'd they tear it down? Jeez. Then we rented some more rooms. We used to rent rooms down this street, but it got when we got a new pickup, it wouldn't fit anymore. <laughs> so we we couldn't stay here. We had to find better parking. There's our long and winding road. There. I'll tell you, it's just really a shame that everything, all the destruction here, it used to be just so nice. But hopefully they'll build it back up and make it nice once again. We'll see. Oh boy. Okay, we go back now. Mama, I got coconut. Is it Lamit? Yeah, Lamit. It's very good. Tamis is sweet. Tamis means sweet. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Yeah. Look, they have nice shirts here. I have this one also here. You're going to buy that one? No. Oh, oh well, shark. And that's a tourist. Oh, we got some snorkelers. Snorkelers. Uh. 